Hey everybody, what's up so far? Right now, we are going to play Life is Strange True Colors. I'm starting to really like this game, that kind of stuff. Like, I don't know. It's like really fun to make about the decisions, but unfortunately, I'm going to have to do streamer safe, that kind of stuff. I don't know, like... It's uh, just for like, let's say, reasons, that kind of thing as well. It's like, some of the music is good, but I'm posting these on YouTube in case, like, you guys missed it. That's, um, that's why, that kind of thing. But, I don't know, it still reminds me, like, every time I hear True Colors, it's like with the lyric song, You with the Sad Eyes. So, enough chat, let's play. Okay, so where we left off, um, here's the skimmy so far, like, or on my last video on my YouTube channel. Um, so far, Alex Chen, like, moved into, like, this new place, um, called Haven, and then basically met up with, like, her older brother, Gabe. Then, like, decided to live together, um, apparently they went to go in, and then, like, something went horribly wrong, and basically, like, Alex found, out, um, Alex told Gabe about her powers, and then, like, they went to find, like, this boy, I think, named Ethan, who went to the mines, and then, like, they tried to save Ethan, and apparently, like, there was this huge explosion where a bunch of rocks came in, and then, like, Gabe was, like, fell, and Alex tried to pull up, but then, like, this guy Ryan cut the rope, and yeah. Like, I don't know. Like, we're, like, a lot. It's a lot to take in, I know. Okay, why isn't my, like, thing connected? Okay, perfect. Ugh, I hate to do this. Audio, live stream. You. Mute license music. Oh man. Plus, it's a lot brighter around here because, like, I just got, like, this new lamp, that kind of stuff, to, like, help me, like, brighten up things as well. Anyway, let's go! Oh, and don't mind me, I may have to, like, pull on and off that kind of stuff because I'm also doing a little bit of laundry as well. Chapter 2 Lanterns. I still can't believe Ryan would cut the rope, though. I'm not big on speeches. I've always believed that the role of the bartender Aww. is to shut up and listen. And by that measure, Gabe was the worst bartender I've ever known. Rude. But, ugh. I never issued a speeding ticket to someone on a bicycle before. Till he came along. A bicycle. He cared so much about my admissions essay. Even though he probably couldn't spell admissions <laughs> or essay. <laughs> he booked my band to play the lantern all the way from Seattle pretty much right where I'm standing. <laughs> I can recall 14 specific instances where Gabe said something that made me laugh. Aww. <laughs> he even wrote it down. The first was two years ago. So, long story short, instead of a ticket, I ended up buying him a beer. Gabe stood like three feet away, grinning like a doofus at us. Aww. I'm sure there were more people, but I only remember him. And then he said, I know, that's why the K is silent. 
Uh, then the fifth time... He cared about everyone. I really like how they managed to capture the tears. He was the kind of guy you wanted to be around. He was a world-class bullshitter. He was my best friend. All I want to say about Gabe is... He came into this bar as a stranger. But he left it as family. <clears throat> Guess that's that then. What happened to Gabe? was a senseless, tragic accident. And I just wish it that- It wasn't an accident. Son, now is not the time. Gabe called the mine. I gave him my sat phone to be sure he could get through. They fucked up. And now, now Gabe's dead. That was my shift. If anyone had called, it would have gone through me. Nobody called. You're lying. Oh, tension. In front of Gabe's own fucking sister. Alex heard the whole thing. Uh... Well, I didn't... I didn't hear Gabe make the call. But he told us he got through. Well, if Gabe said something, then I'm inclined to believe him, Mac. What are you saying? I'm not saying anything. Just, I didn't get a call. Draw your own conclusions. All right, folks. This is an ongoing investigation. How about that we review the sequence of events? Hmm? Well, son, when I oh, saw you at the crap. record store, you seemed pretty Things are getting eager really violent. Gabe. Remember why? Hmm? Another fight with Riley, maybe? No, I don't have to take this. Just saying, pretty wild that you come stumbling out of Gabe's apartment with your face all fucked up. Right. And just a couple hours later, you just so happened to miss the call that would have saved his life? Look, I told you there was no call to miss. Hey, maybe the call got dropped. Oh shit, I mean, it's not like, it's not like Gabe was Mr. Reliable all the time. You watch your mouth, Mac. Ryan, that's enough. Now I'm just Alex as eager it. as you to the understand anger. all this, son. The aura of red. Oh shit, Dad. This little weasel's calling Gabe a liar at his own fucking wake. Hell, I am just telling you. Mac, I swear if you say there was no call one more fucking time. Stop it! Stop it now! Things are getting really intense in this part, guys. This is not the time or place. We're all here for Gabe. Okay, Ryan? Sure, I'm... I'm sorry. It's not... I'm just trying... Whoa. I'm not the one who killed him. <laughs> Aren't you, though? What the fuck did you just say? Ryan, back off. Oh, hell. I'm just saying, oh, just I as thought I, thought I, I was like, that you were the one. You shut the hell up. No. No, go ahead. You got something to say, Mac? Let's fucking hear Come it. Come on, guys. Don't make me interrupt. All right. Fine. As long as we're tossing around accusations, way I hear it, you're the guy who cut the rope. Why not you? That's it. Wait's over. Everyone, out! <sighs> Whoa. Alex feels it.
Alex? <sighs> hey. Fuck those guys. <sighs> yeah. Are you okay? Uh... For now. We'll see how long that lasts. Okay, Gabe knows about our power. Maybe we should just, like start spilling it's not to your like job Steph to keep as it well. Together. <clears throat> Thanks. Do you um it's messy, but I mean I don't know who to trust. Do you want to come in? As well, I mean, should sure. we tell Steph about our powers? Like, I'm not even sure myself. You play guitar? It was a gift. Sort of. It was a gift. From Gabe. Cool. The awkward silence lingers. Gabe would try to pop wheelies outside the record store to make me laugh. Never worked. Till he wiped out. That was hilarious. Gabe really wanted to do the LARP for Ethan. Aww. <clears throat> but by the end of it, he was more jazzed about it than anybody. Wish I could have seen it. We took this a year ago. We... It's wrong, Steph. No way. I can't. What? You actually kept it. Oh. Sorry. I just need a minute. Yeah. Uh, no problem. Calm down, Alex. You're fine. You're fine. Whatever that bottle made her think of, it really messed her up. I wonder if I could help her the same way I helped Ethan. I need to feel her sadness to figure out how to help her. Okay. Let's do it. <clears throat> Foosball champion? Why would that make her so sad? Okay. Reading the aura time. Ah. Rain. So it was a rainy night then that Steph and Gabe were together here. Now I can find out what's really going on with Steph. What are they called again? Don't shit on my yard! They're amazing! Their guitarist has one arm! Badass. The foosball. <laughs> Dude, give it up. I already booked a bus ticket. Wait, wait, hear me out. 
one more game. If I win, you have to stay. If you win, I'll cover the ticket. You just lost 50 bucks. Whoa. Has to be more than that. Damn it, fucking overpowered blue meteor. Aww, <laughs> is your controller broken too? We're playing until I win. Then I'll be crashing here tonight. Okay, the bottle. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting your new foosball champion, Gabe Chen. Oh, you're the worst. Can't believe I have to stay in this stupid town. I think we both know you could have beat me if you really wanted to. So you're welcome. Bullshit. So I think I'm getting it somewhere. Like... <clears throat> stuff? Um, stuff it... Let's see. So far from what we're hearing, it's like... Steph wanted to see, um, is having, like, some kind of, like, war with herself, though. Like, as much as she wants to, like, leave the town, she also wants to, like, stay as well I because of the game. I need to find out why Steph is so upset. But I guess we'll see if that's true or not, because, like, I kind of feel that vibe from Steph, and especially all the memories. Steph? Sorry. This is so embarrassing. I just need some time. Okay. There has to be more things around here. I could basically try to see like what's going on. Here's to your new job at the station. Oh, didn't I tell you? I'm not taking it. I move to Denver next week. You what? I think I know enough to help her now. In conclusion, Steph wants to, like, leave town. Still can't believe he's gone. Yeah. He's the whole reason I'm still... I'm sorry, Alex. Don't mind me. I could put on a record, if you like. Nah, not really in the mood. Maybe something else? Um... A drink. Can I get you a drink or anything? That's the only thing that I can think so no, far. Thanks. I appreciate the offer though. Sure. Foosballs and video games are also- That wasn't all, right. like, probably not one of the things. Okay, foosball. I mean, that's the only thing that's related to that empty wine, um, that empty bottle that Gabe labeled. How about a quick match? Did Gabe tell you he played? Uh, had a hunch. I just had a hunch. Yeah, well, you're right. I don't really think it's a great time. Fine. First to five points? If you say so. Use LT. So, how often did you and Gabe play? It was one of our favorite games. You must be pretty good then. Mm-hmm. You were in a band, right? Yeah. What'd you play? Drums. Ooh. Ah! How, uh, how long did you play with them? <sighs> Too long. Gotcha. Ah! 
This game is like kind of confusing. Okay. Five points! That's game! Yep. Big shocker. Oh, hey, at least you played your best. I mean, that obviously wasn't my best. No. I get it. I mean, this is a tough game. It requires skill, timing, and the will to be a champion. Oh, is that how it is? It's great to be okay, playing with okay. you. Joking aside, playing this stupid game with you is exactly what I need right now. You're on. Oh, not again. <laughs> I hate this game. I'm actually trying this time, so you better focus. I am focusing. Good. Wouldn't want you to get distracted or anything. Certainly not. Hey, hey, yeah. Hey. Greatest Northwest band of all time. Go. Um. Are you trying to just Mariana's me? Trench? Of course not. Slater Kinney, if you were wondering. Okay, I'm catching up. Ah! Ha! Woo! Shit. Oh, that's a win. I was actually trying that time. <laughs> okay, woo wait. Let's get serious. One more game, winner takes title of ultimate foosball champion. Oh, you're on. Oh, no. Come on. You know, Gabe would be all about us playing like this. Well, then it's settled. Okay. <laughs> this is it for all the marbles. So many marbles. Definitely the kind of game you want to focus on, <sighs> no matter what happens. Totally. Okay, one. Hey, Power kick. so are you into girls or what? Uh. <laughs> I mostly dated guys before, actually. Oh, yeah? Do they listen to CDs of bird calls? Because I could hook you up. <laughs> Can't say I've ever dated a bird call enthusiast before. Okay, that definitely sounds like Ryan. I mean, you gotta admit, the guy's cute. Who's what? What? Fuck. <laughs> I knew it. How old are you exactly? Old enough to know better. Ugh, we're down. Ah. Oh no, my battery. Oh, <laughs> fucking finally. The house of Chen crumbles at last. <laughs> well, at least we got stuff back in the mood. Good game. Be right back. Thank you. You're a much better loser than Gabe. That's no fun. Sorry to spoil the victory.
So, what are you gonna do now? What do you mean? That shit with Mac. He's clearly lying, right? Okay. What I missed. Uh, let's see. Need to learn more. I'm not sure what Max Steele is. His story doesn't add up. Yeah. I do know that I need to find out exactly what happened that night. <clears throat> for myself and for Gabe. I've got your back. No matter what. All right, we got Thank an you. ally means a lot. I should head back to work. Cool. I guess like with Steph's sorrows, I guess he just, she'd just be Bye. playing like blues and like some like kind of like Bye. depressing songs, that kind of stuff. But Steph is a really cool friend to like have though. <clears throat> I know Gabe made that call, but did Mac really let the blast go off just to get back at him? Okay, if Mac did, that's low. Like, super low. See? I can be a person. Hey, hey Shushu. Shushu. Thanks for sticking around. Fuck. I just got him back. How can he be gone? I know. Let's see. Let's get some fresh clothes. I like do like this one. Feels like a million years since that day with Gabe. Hasn't even been a week. Why are dishes always the first thing to slip when your life falls apart? Desperation, that kind of thing? It's a start. <clears throat> okay. That did make me feel a little better. Well, we might as well, like, see what else we can clean up around here. Broken puzzle piece. Okay, not broken. Incomplete puzzle piece. Cape really meant the world to Steph. Thank God for this thing. We'd never have found Ethan without it. Definitely. What's At this? least I got to have a few good <clears throat> moments. Sorry I didn't play along, Gabe. 
Ooh, snowboarding. Would have been fun to see Gabe crush some sweet powder. Or whatever snowboarders say. Come on, let's go upstairs. I think we need some fresh air from after all this. I mean, with everything, I know we just moved in, but it doesn't feel like right with Gabe anymore. The answer, my friend, is blowing in the wind. <clears throat> Sorry. Just throw a thing. <sighs> I'll toss those soon. I swear. We should have gotten so many more sunsets. Why look up at the sky when you could look at a sculpture instead? No birds today. Aww. Gabe really loved this place. <clears throat> he must have also loved it into a town. I mean, I won't be surprised if he went like Republic of Sara, as in turned the town into a country. Gabe was such a dad. <clears throat> This from you could stay here too. I wouldn't try to stop you. Yeah, good. I'll be the only trans person in a town with a population of like four. That sounds like a blast for me. Thanks for not trying to stop me. I'm sorry, Izzy. It's not you, and it's not the band. I fucking love that shit. But I need to try this. It's just time for something new. I knew it. I knew this would happen eventually. Fucking... See you around, Steph. Damn. <clears throat> I bet Gabe could even make golf fun. I highly doubt it. I guess we could just sit out and take a, and take a look at the scenery. I thought this was going to be the one. Finally. Despite all the disappointments, I really let myself believe. Aww. I believed you completely. I let myself hope, really hope. For the first time in years. Even after I freaked out in front of you and hit you, you didn't push me away. Aww. You sat right there and told me that I wasn't broken, that I was special, and I belonged. Then you died, and I don't know what to believe now, except you're gone again, and I'm still here. Alone. Aww. I feel like... Okay, I'm getting a lot of Kikyo vibes from this one, that kind of thing as well. <clears throat> Guess there's not much to do so far. Come on, let's go downstairs.
looks like there was a fight that's broken out between Mac and Ryan. And Pike was the one that tried to like break up the fight. Things got pretty heated back there. I guess we'll just try to clean up some of the places just as well. Oh, hey kid, you don't have to do that. Too late. It's okay. Wanted to apologize. For all of us. We're all grieving, but that's no excuse. It was your brother's wake, and you both deserve better than listening to a bunch of fools squabble. Uh, yeah. Appreciate the apology, I at least. I appreciate it. That was pretty rough. Although it's hard to imagine a good version of your dead brother's wake. No. There's no good version. Just all of us trying to get through it together the best we can. It wasn't the first wake held in this old building. I doubt it'll be the last. Anyway, if there's anything I can do, just let me know. I need to talk to Mac. <clears throat> I know he's lying. I just don't know why. Any idea where I can I'm find him? I'm not sure if this is even a good idea. Yeah, he helps out I mean, Eleanor at the flower shop. That'd be the place to start. Thanks. Alex is grieving, so... I feel like I should warn you, though. You might not get the kind of closure you're looking for. If you get any at all. Just... Don't pin all your hopes on Mac Loudon. Um, thanks for the advice. Thanks for looking out for me, but what else am I supposed to do? I wish I had an answer for you. <clears throat> but if you get a chance before you go all dirty, Harry, <clears throat> swing by the dispensary. Charlotte wants to see you. And one more thing. Sure. I've been meaning to give you this for the last few days, but I didn't want to disturb you up there. It'll get you through that door and the one upstairs. Cool, the master key. Thanks, Jed. This is your home now. For as long as you'd like. What about rent? I don't want to be a freeloader. Don't worry about that for right now. We'll work out a way for you to earn your keep when the time comes. Thank you. Give him hell. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, hey, a new message. <clears throat> I... I have no idea what to even say to him. Let's see. Hey, Alex, I'm so sorry. I should have saved him. I don't know what to say. Hey, that was terrible. You shouldn't have to see that. I know you're going through a lot, but can we talk? I know it's asking a lot, but I think we I really need to talk to you. I don't even know. I mean, like... I think Ryan's trying to make amends for, like, what he's did, that kind of stuff, but... A year ago, I was ready to ditch this place, to keep moving like I always do. And a year ago, Gabe was the reason I stayed. But even though he's gone now, and even though I miss him like hell, I still have the reasons to say thank you for, you for showing me that, Alex. Even if your foosball skill could use some work, I'm down for a rematch if you are. Oh, that's typical of Mac. Aww, Gabe was the most caring person I've ever met. He never stopped looking for ways to make life better. Whether he meant coming to... Haven to find his dad or fighting to get a grill all the way up the stairs to his rooftop And he was always willing to help anyone else who wanted to improve their life He probably put even more hours into my college interview than I did He was the kind of person you meet once in a lifetime. Goodbye Gabe. I'll miss you forever. Lovely message, dear I'm here if you want to talk. Same here
Aww. Phone messages. We're having a send-out for Gabe Chen at the Lantern on Wednesday at 9 a.m. All are welcome. Bring something that reminds you of him. I'll bring some food for everyone, too. Thanks, Jason. The Silver and Dragon will be operating e hours for the next few weeks. Check out the website for more details. Sorry for any inconvenience. Let me know if there's anything I can do for you. Hang in there. You're not alone. I can open the shop for you if you need. Whatever I can do. The Guinness County Sheriff's Department is working hard to serve and protect the citizens of Haven Springs. If you have any questions and concerns you would like to report on crime vandalism, you can always contact us over the phone through our website or speaking with an inner deputy. When will hike the hiking trails be opening again? Unfortunately, the trails we've closed are still part of the active investigation. We'll get them open as soon as we can. Can't we just put this to bed? He was where he shouldn't have been. Shit happens. Okay, that's harsh. Someone eager to give Typhon a pass. A person died. That doesn't mean anything to you people. This poster has disabled any further replies. Wow, oh, there's a lot of rage and hatred in this one. <clears throat> Sony Anderson. I even got a good handyman. We can't seem to get any hot water to the upstairs showers. I offer you lending I offered to lend you it, Ryan, but it might be a while before he's feeling up to it. Yeah, I get it. Thanks, Amy Chad. I used to be a handyman back in Philly. I can take a look at it free of charge if you want. Lifesaver. In the dark Eleanor Lith, in the darkness that surrounds the death of a loved one, I think it's important to remember the good times, so I want to share one of my favorite memories of Gabe Chun. I just saw a bouquet of flowers, and he admitted that he put his foot in his mouth again with his girlfriend and needed to make it up with her. I sent him on his way with some lovely tulips, but 15 minutes later, there he was again. I asked, Charlotte, if I could have her two lips in exchange for these tulips, so now I'm back. What a guy. Practically kept us in business. I think I actually remembered this. Guys, she could sure light up a room. No kidding. I feel sick. Here at Typhoon Mining, we are shocked and saddened to hear about Gabe Chen's death. Such a loss is always tragic and affected many in our community. We would like to take this time to assure the community that Typhoon remains committed, as always, to follow the strictest safety practices in the industry. Your community is our community and will and we will cooperate with any and all law enforcement investigations until this matter can be properly laid to rest. The poster has disabled replies. I won't be surprised though, I mean like, they probably be like, getting a lot of backlash from the public. Let's see, excited to have an addition to the Black Lantern staff, happy to have you Alex, maybe you could teach her a thing. Aww. One of her neighbors changed the relationship status. Riley Leather is now single. Proud of you, sweetie. Ouch, Mac. Mazel tov. I guess that's all. No one could blame me for wanting to drink all my sorrows away. R, M, and T, B. I wonder who they were. <clears throat> Jed definitely has a decorating style. I'd call it steakhouse sh Okay, let's go. <clears throat> like, I don't even know, like, I think we should talk to Ryan first. What do you guys think? Like, I think we should have, like, talked to Ryan, like, trying to make peace with him, I mean... From what had happened with Gabe, that kind of stuff. Okay. Jed said I might find Mac in the flower shop. I think I want to forgive But her. I have time to swing by the dispensary, if I want. Charlotte, thank you. I'm so sorry. Thank you so much. Alex, can you come by this, this, um, the dispensary sometime? I think I need your advice. Sure thing. Steph. Hey, do you have a second to swing by the store? Mm, maybe. What's up? Nothing big. I'll tell you when you get here. <clears throat> Dear Alex, it was very much my pleasure meeting you in the evening. I hope you are find a welcoming home here in Haven. I look forward much, oh, very much forward to our next meeting. Sincerely, Reginald McAllister III. Uh, thanks. Alex, I'm so sorry. Please let me know if there's anything I can do. Morning, Alex. Do you get my notes? I'm holding a small service for Gabe at 9am 
today. If you care to join us, no pressure at all. Thanks, Jet. I'll be down soon. Glad to hear. Okay. This is probably the most haven thing I've seen yet. Haven thing? <clears throat> I wonder how that Pike Pike's is doing. really had his work cut out for him these last few days. <clears throat> uh, hey, Pike. Hey, Pike. Hey! Um, how you holding up? Um... Guess I've been better. Yeah, right. Dumb question. Oh no, not at all. Hey, I want you to know I meant what I said back there. Gabe was something else. He could bring a smile to my face even on the worst days. Yeah, that's what everyone's been saying. And, uh, when you're ready, I still need to get your statement for the investigation. Uh... <sighs> I really want to say that Mac is a liar, but... I will be ready soon. I really want to, like, try yeah. to do things first. Like, yeah. stop by the dispensary no and... Just comfort Ryan. Like... Ugh, I don't even know what to think of Ryan anymore. Like, you know what I mean? Like... I'm mad at him for, like, cutting the rope and not saving Gabe, that kind of stuff. But at the same time, I can't blame him as well for doing that. I wonder what Pikes is feeling. Poor kid. Came all the way out here for her brother. And now... And now, I've got to figure out the truth. We should go in aura reading mode. It's bullshit. We have a right to know what's happening to our jobs. <clears throat> you guys don't think anything's really gonna change, right? It's a tight for eight years of my life, and they can't give me back one simple answer about my job. Typhon doesn't give a shit about anyone. I just might be a good time to check out the dispensary. Jed said Charlotte wants to talk to me. Yeah, maybe. Sorry about today. It's not your fault. Steph asked me to pop by the record store if I had time. Where exactly is the dispensary? Someone died up in the ravine a few days ago. One doctor had me try meditation. I always just fell asleep. I'm... Um, yeah. Wind chimes. The original jam band. Okay, we got sadness, rage... Nice to know. Hipsters can survive at this altitude. Assuming is that they're in a small town, like Haven. Like, I don't know. I would definitely w would love to visit, visit Haven if it's like a real place, that kind of stuff. <clears throat> I just hope the council passes the vote. So... Might be a good time to check out the dispensary. Jed said Charlotte wants to talk to me. And where exactly is the dispensary? Want to do something together next week? Sure. I have a pottery class Wednesday night. Want to join? Uh, class? <clears throat> oh, sorry. Oh, hey. We met briefly. You're Gabe Chen's sister, right? That's right. Alex, yeah. I didn't know him well, but I could tell he had a big heart. I'm so sorry for your loss. Um... Thanks, Diane. That was weird. <clears throat> mm. 
Whoa. <clears throat> Charlotte? Alex? Hey. Jed said you wanted to see me? I just wanted to see how you were doing. Um... I'm okay. Keeping my chin up. Head up. Sometimes that's all you can do. And trying standing tall and proud. How about you? With pride. I can't even imagine what you're going through. <clears throat> Honestly, I'm really trying to keep it together for Ethan. He's hurting. I hear he's been having a rough time. He practically just lost a father. But he's shutting me out. He's never done that before. Not when it mattered. <clears throat> Stay strong. You'll get through the hard parts. Both of you. Easier said than done, huh? I guess yeah. so. No shit. I should have chosen the second option, though. I can't get over the feeling that the one person who could help me deal with the aftermath of Gabe's death is Gabe. What is this? An affidavit from Typhon. If I sign, I'm agreeing not to press charges in exchange for a payment. A big one. Damn it. That's so shady. Why would they be offering you money if they didn't do anything wrong? They say it's an offer of good faith, but you're right. He's dead because of them. And I'd be letting them off. Yeah, I'm not buying in this one. Are you gonna sign it? Alex! I don't know. I'm trying to put Ethan first, but... What would you do? Do you think it would be a betrayal of Gabe? Oh, shit. Ugh. I don't think you should sign it. I'm sorry. I know it's hard, but you can't let Typhon buy you off. Gabe made that call, and I'm gonna prove it. I just, I need some time. Thanks for being honest. <sighs> I thought she'd be pissed. If they're willing to pay Charlotte to keep quiet, they're <clears throat> definitely hiding something. Definitely. Glass pipes are so cool. They're like works of art that can also get you high. I really appreciate you stopping by. Feel free to take a look around if you want. I'm gonna Thanks, figure Charlotte. out why Max lying. I see why Gabe was so in love with her. Sweet logo. Bet Charlotte designed it herself. Okay, yeah, it does look like a cool logo. These bougie dispensaries are gonna put all the creepy dudes named Jean out of business. Well, at Given least there's the company. Circumstances, I could definitely go for a few of these. Ah! Wait a minute. I never downloaded this. Ah! My game! What happened to my game? 
Okay, let's try this again. Oh, shit. Okay, let's try this again. Um... Uh... Processes... Like, why isn't anything working? Oh crap, 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 crap. Um... Um... What do I do? What do I do? Oh shit! Um... <sighs> think, think, think. What to do, what to do, what to do, what to do. Okay guys, uh, just give me a second. Okay. Crisis averted, I think. Okay, that was weird. Let's try again. Sorry guys, I didn't know what happened, but we are definitely trying it this again. But first... Uh, live stream. Okay, everything's exactly how it's supposed to be. Okay, let's get back. If they're willing to pay Charlotte to keep quiet, they're definitely hiding something. Of course, she's right. But I could really use that money. We can't give in, no matter how hard it is. I really appreciate you stopping by. Feel free to take a look around if you want. Okay, where were we? Oh yeah. yeah. Charlotte's dedication to her art is so inspiring. And which part of the brain is responsible for the crazy glowy feelies? I don't know. It could be God. like something that she was- Put some clothes on. Mary Jane Magazine. Try this new growing trick for big- well, What? 
Nugs. High and dry have to tell if you're buying waterlogged wheat. How long does THC really stay in your system? Which vape is right for you? Check out this buyer guide. Strain list. When did you start needing a PhD to smoke pot? Silver Dragon strain list. Stravia. Whoa. Whoa. Stairway to Haven. Believe it or not, Gabe named that one. Oh, I believe it. It blows my mind that Charlotte's been running the dispensary this whole time. I couldn't even leave the apartment. Whoa. Wonder what it's like to have I do my drugs out of a glass sculpture type of- And he did it all with one rusty saw and a bottle of gin. Impressive. Okay. So this place used to be like the general store or like the pharmacy or at least the doctor clinic or something back then. Alex. Still need to check the flower shop for Mac. I wouldn't know where to even find it. Ballot noticed. I might be too close to the issue to have an unbiased opinion, but fuck this. Read. Town Haven Council vote notice. An official council meeting will be held on May 26 to decide what. One measure. This measure proposed selling property of no more than twenty acres to Typhoon Mining for use in open pit mines. Both of the sale profits and subsequent property taxes will be added to the overall budget of Haven Spring to be divided and spent throughout the stand procedure. More information is still is available at Town Hall. Talk to the council manager if you have any further questions and concerns. Nothing says festive like. Three exclamation points. Yeah. And if it's sponsored by a mining company. Okay. This location gets all the foot traffic. And word around the water cooler is the mining company is about to expand. More jobs means more customers for you. Oh, customers here are a lot nicer than in Denver. Never been to Denver. But I guarantee they're nice here. 100%. The park looks fun to explore. They've been the largest employer in Haven for decades. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Wind chime, bikes. Oh, I never got to the whole bench part. Steph asked me to pop by the record store if I had time. Let's do it. I mean, I'm sure we have plenty of time. Like, I really think Alex should, like, first calm her... Um, well, she's grieving. Just, like... I don't even know what to even put it anymore, that kind of thing. Hey, Steph. Steph asked me to swing by. She's got to be around here somewhere. Helpful. Be back in five or ten. Maybe fifteen. Comp Looks book. like Steph might be working on a new project. Another issue of legendary monster hunter Thanor. What do you got? The breakup section, huh? That's rough, buddy. How could Chrissy leave me? After everything we've been through together. It's hard to beat breakup music. But maybe I can find something around here to cheer him up. Um I 
There's Steph. Hey, I'm glad you stopped by. I've only got a sec, but... What is it? Have you talked to Ethan at all? Not... really. He's taking it really hard. But what you did for me this morning got me thinking. What if Ethan needs something like that too? Something fun and distracting. Something like a LARP. Like... costumes, foam swords, that kind of thing? Yeah, but designed just for him and Thanor. Uh... Yeah! I love that. Yeah? I'm glad you think so. I need your help, though. I want it to be as good as it can be. Ethan gave you one of his comics, right? Yeah. So? What do you think? Who would the famous monster slayer have the most fun defeating? Ooh, I like the one on the right, though. Oh, but the left is really good. Uh... B. Cravius looks pretty badass. Go with that. <laughs> Alright then. Oh, I gotta get back in there. There's some stuff in my comp book. Be cool if you could check it out. Help me make some calls. I'll see what I can do. Oh, crap. Hey, uh, Haven listeners. That was Phone Tap with their new single, Elephant in the Room. Ugh, lagging. We've got a sweet block of indie rock coming. Okay. The rock coming down the pike, but first, a few announcements. The Spring Festival is just around the corner, sponsored by Typhon Mining Company. Admission is free this year, so bring your friends, bring your family. We will help, help step later. Ass. Sure, it'll be different this time. Okay, that is like one of the most harshest things ever to be said. <sighs> I. Okay, that's it. I am not installing two games at once, that kind of thing. Give me a second. Uh, let's see. One new item in my inventory. Ugh, not sure what to make of this one, anyway. But we are trying this again. Yeah, I downloaded an NC Drew game. I like that game. Blah, 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 blah. Continue. Like, I should stream Nancy Drew one day, that kind of stuff. Like, they're really fun, that kind of thing. Sometimes the puzzle can be really complicated, that kind of stuff, but... Let's play together, one day. Steph asked me to swing by. She's gotta be around here somewhere. Okay, it'll be cool to run hey, a radio I'm station. I'm glad you stopped by. I've only got a sec, but... Have you spoke with Ethan? Have you talked to Ethan at all? No. He's taking it really hard. But what you did for me this morning got me thinking. What if Ethan needs something like that too? Something fun and distracting. Something like a LARP. Like... costumes, foam swords, that kind of thing? Yeah, but designed just for him and Thanor. Ooh. He'll love that. Yeah, I'm glad you think so. I need your help, though. I want it to be as good as it can be. Ethan gave you one of his comics, right? Yeah. So, what do you think? Who would the famous monster slayer have the most fun defeating? Ooh. 
I love Ethan's character designs though. Cravius looks pretty badass. Go with that. <laughs> All right then. Oh, I gotta get back in there. There's some stuff in my comp book. It'd be cool if you could check it out. Help me make some calls. I'll see what I can do. Hey, uh, Haven listeners. That was Phone Tap with their new single, Elephant in the Room. We've got a sweet block of indie rock coming down the pike, but first, a few announcements. Oh. Looks like Steph wants me to do more than just make some decisions. Fall in your She what? wants me to play a bard. Alex, fill in your character. The bard. Blank, half elf, rat. Abilities to certain fields with healing serades. Level 1. 10 health points. How do you make then? Okay, we could do this. This is fun. Guess I'm in. Let's start with my name. The mission is free this year, so bring your friends. Bring Alexandria. Your Help. Bring your eyes. I'm sure it'll be There's different. beauty and simplicity. Ability time. Distortion field sounds fun, but healing serenade could really come in handy. Distortion field. Let's go with distortion field. How did I meet Thanor? Uh, I saved him. It was a dark and stormy night. This LARP thing just might work. So, Ethan's comic book. So, his like character is like human? I don't know, I mean, if I had to do that, I'd probably be half demon, half celestial, half whatever, that kind of stuff. Like, super powerful and everything, that kind of thing. But the rest of the is always like. For Mac. Steph's phone. Hey, saw what you did with the LARP. Thank you so much, of course. I think Ethan's going to love it. I don't get it. Do people just not want ice cream anymore? I looked over the budget. I have to keep up a brave face for Angela. She loves our store so much. He must be exhausted. Yeah. Things will get better. Piratey Peaches is making an actual profit, remember? Fine. You were right about Piratey Peaches. Oh, I was right. We're losing our business. But it's like, everything's a joke to him. She must feel so alone. Hope they figure it out. Sooner or later. It's, harder. it's surprisingly addictive. You haven't been putting actual rum in it again, have you? Uh, no. Really? Anyway, I took out a radio ad too. That'll help. Please say it's not the one you read to me the other day. That was so weird. It's not weird, it's fun. Don't you like fun? Sunny. It makes an impression. Don't worry, okay? Damn. Sounds gonna make a comeback. Trust me. I sure hope you're right. Damn, invisible wall. I guess that's the limit border of the game. <clears throat> I don't even know if we're even ready to face Mac. I mean, I'm not even sure we're ready to face Ryan either. Hello? Eleanor? Oh! oh. Sorry. <clears throat> no need to apologize. How are you, dear? Uh... Oh. I'm, um... Still just 
trying to adjust, I think. Okay, first episode of the Vampire Diaries. Give yourself some time. It's sometimes you're getting really tired Change is of, always like, hard. people asking you how you've been so far. Especially when you're going through a loss like this. Uh, is Mac here? Oh, he was helping me not too long ago. I think he just left. Can't have gotten too far. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Thanks. Now, what was I? Oh, crap. Hmm. <laughs> she seems worried about something. Is it about Gabe? She looks terrified. I can't leave her like this. Okay. <clears throat> Whoa. <clears throat> did they have a, did Mac had an argument with her? Okay. Time to figure out why she's afraid. Oh my memories, oh, my memories are fading. Are fading. I feel, I feel Broken. Broken. Whoa. Flowers. The doctor said I had more time, but everything is becoming so out of order. Um. If they know about my condition. They'll make me close this place. Condition what? Closing? <clears throat> Never been back here. If Riley finds out. She can't find out. Find out about what? Thank you, dear. I'll get started on it right away. Just come by with the check whenever you're free. Holy shit. Whoa. What is happening? It's not just that she forgot what she was doing. She's afraid she's forgetting everything. But how can I help her? Memory loss, maybe. Forget what you were working on? <sighs> you could say I'm having a bit of a senior moment. <laughs> well, maybe I can help. Uh... You could focus on something else for a bit and see if it comes back. Yeah. I suppose. But I can't help feeling like it was something important. Important. Whatever it was. Retrace your steps. Seems like you have a lot going on today. I could help you retrace your steps. Yeah. Oh, um, uh, I don't want to keep you. Ah, uh, it's okay. We're cool. Hey. I just want to help. I want to help. Okay. Okay. What would Eleanor have done first? Um. Did you trim these flowers today? 
I... don't remember. Okay, maybe not that. You must have flipped the sign to open. I always flip it first thing when I come in. And then I open my mail. Something must have distracted me. Mac. Better. We can do this. Okay, let's see. Open mail. You were over here when I came in. Maybe you were counting the drawer. Maybe? You don't have to do this. I'll be alright on my own. Hey. I'm not going anywhere. Oh, uh, let's see what else she could have done. Did anything happen with Riley? I... I don't know. Okay. Uh, Could a phone? phone call have distracted you? Yeah, if she had any calls today. Yes. I got a call first thing in the morning. But I can't think who it was. Maybe we can find something to remind you. Okay. It could have been Riley. Could it have been Riley who called? I think that's right. She called to tell me about a new order. Oh, goodness. What was the order for? Okay. Check. Maybe for flowers? Rush order. This must be what Riley came in for. I think that order might have been for these lilies. Of course. Riley helped me pick them out before Excuse she me. left. Okay. Now we just have to figure out who ordered them. Paid in check. The check for the lilies would be in here, right? That could tell us who bought them. It should. Mr. Jedediah Lucan. Huh. Jedediah Lucan. Let's see. Road, Haven Springs, paid to order. Left of flowers, $89. Arrangement bag scanned. Okay. Looks like the lilies are for Jed. That's right. Riley dropped off an order for Jed. I knew you'd figure it out. I couldn't have done it without you. Thanks. Jed must be hosting some event. I wonder why he wants lilies, though. They're traditionally for funerals. Gabe. God. She doesn't remember. Uh, yeah. Tell her about Gabe. We gotta talk to somebody, and we can't pull this up anymore. They were, they were for Gabe's wake. Gabe's wake? Gabe's wake. I missed it. Ah, <laughs> uh, we should have spared her the pain. Alex, I'm. I'm so sorry. Hey, it's um. It's okay. Excuse me. <laughs> Thank you. 
Great. Well, that was supposed to okay. that went well that's supposed that to be sucked. expected. But at least I told her the truth. Okay, let's see her mail. I hope it's good news. She's really hurting, but I didn't want to lie to her. Okay, Riley is officially a badass. Definitely. <clears throat> I've definitely lived in uglier places. Okay, it does not look that ugly. That's for sure. Help. That take care of the flower shop. Well, let's go talk to Ryan. I think that's the one, like, well, between Mac and, like, Ryan. I'm not sure if we're, I'm, or Alex, mostly I'm ready to, like, meet up. Eleanor said Mac is nearby. I don't see him here. Maybe at the bridge? Jasmine, calling me. Anyone has good advice for training stray cats? Found this cutie in my trash can, but he's a crazy pants. So, that's a big cat. He's a chonker. Jasmine, that's not a stray cat. That's a mountain lion cub. Be very careful. They can be very aggressive when threatened. They try leaving a door open. Maybe it leaves on its own. And if it's under my bed, broom. I'm calling ammo control. Hmm, I wonder what Steph's working on. It could look cool. I should DM her and find out to see how more I can help out. Okay, that is badass. Okay, this one's pretty funny. Let's go. This song. I have to imagine Gabe would be amused to know he made it in the newspaper. At least the local cancel paper. AAA membership. No, I, I said cancel. Yeah, a warning would have been nice. Cancel. Ooh, this is such a nice mural. Guess they didn't feel like painting the mine. I wonder what if he's right. innocent, why is he acting like this? Acting like what? Maybe I Hey Riley. What's wrong? Alex. Hey. Um, that fight Mac had with Gabe over your secret meetings, they were about you applying to college, right? Yeah. Ever since the first time Mac lost his shit in front of him, Gabe and Charlotte had tried to get me to end things with him. And after all this, <laughs> I can see that they were right. No kidding. Do you think he could have ignored Gabe's call? I mean, do you think he's capable of that? I don't want to believe that, but... Sorry, I'm really not ready to talk about it. Uh, sure. No way. Okay. I mean, Riley's already in the bad shape already, that kind of stuff. I mean, I don't know. It's like, 
Maybe she still has feelings for Mac, though. But that guy is such a doofus. A hot doofus, at least. Close. How are you doing? I miss him. So much. He was like an older brother to me. Aww. I'm glad he had you. Thank you, Alex. <clears throat> really. Um... You and Eleanor seem close. She's taken care of me ever since I was little. I never really knew my mom, but she's always been there for me. What does she think about you going away to school? She's thrilled. <laughs> I think she just wants me to end up happy. Aww. That's really sweet. She's the most selfless person I know. I know having you work with her in the shop has meant the world. Yeah. To both of us. I gotta run. There's some stuff I need to do. Okay. I am not pushing her about Mac, though. Ugh. I don't want to push Riley, but I need to know more about Mac. How do I get her to open up? Simple but effective. What could be back there? Guess we'll find out. Of course. Damn. Maybe there's something around here I can use to get it open. Grabber toy. I've broken into places for less. I'm sure that it even works. Gasoline. A wagon wheel. Yee. And I cannot stress this enough. Ha. Huh. Not like we can look at other things around here. What else? Camp? Somehow. Even after everything, I never had to live on the street. I hope this person's all right. Aww. Not like we could go upstairs. Let's see what else we could do. Oh shit, that's like the mountain lion I thing. I know what this means. Somewhere, there's a dog I need to pet. Or a mountain lion to stay away from. Do you... want to talk about Mac? Uh... I get it. It's just... 
If he didn't do anything wrong, why is he acting like he has oh something to hide? Oh my god, I'm so cringing in this part. He asked me to leave Haven with him. No. What? Seriously? Right after the wake. He wouldn't tell me why. But he just looked so guilty. I told him no. And that we were done. And now... Yeah, break up with that guy. I'm scared. He did something horrible. Riley. Thank you for telling me. You deserve the truth. I gotta run. There's some stuff I need to do. Okay. We'll talk soon? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Whenever you want. Mac trying to skip town is sketchy as shit. I bet I could use that to stoke his fear. Assuming if we can find him first. The park looks fun to explore. I used to babysit Ethan when he was little. This whole thing is so horrible. Did you see him over by the water? Yeah. There's literally nothing I can do for Ethan. I feel so useless. Aww. I've been there. Where are you hiding, my feathered friend? Please, I need you. Is she looking for a bird? Maybe I'll keep an ear out. Oh, sorry. Oh, cool okay. binoculars. You bird watching? <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to win a contest. Oh, good luck. Thanks. Okay, oh, that was sorry. weird. You're fine. Ooh. It feels so weird to be preparing for a celebration. Definitely. Beer bottles. That could have been around here. I haven't been a bartender long, but I'm pretty sure these are supposed to stay in the bar. You're writing a novel? Since when? I just started. I had what if I die tomorrow? And just like that guy. What have I done with my life? I don't have any easy answers for that. Let's do creative writing. But that wouldn't start in. Okay, we've definitely been here. That might be our feathered friend. Where? I don't see anything. Oh, here we go. I wonder if this is the bird that woman is looking for. Maybe I should let my binocular friend know. What if I'm secretly a total prodigy at disc golf, but never had the chance to find out? Probably for the best, honestly. Yeah, I mean, like, I wouldn't let that fly and then hit someone's window and go like, there's a huge oh, bird over by the wall. Seriously? That might be my hawk. Thank you. Okay, no Mac. Oh, you heard about the accident. 
Was it on the news? No. I wonder how many fish Ducky's caught in this thing. I don't think it's an aura from that person. Ooh, the docks. No, no, it's just like really nice to get away from it all. Oh, wow. Do I even want to stay here without Gabe? In this state I've never been to before. This town I've been in for less than a week. Guess so. I mean, I still want to take Not that, that fresh I know where start. Else I'd even go. Back to the nothing waiting for me in Portland. Fuck. I have no idea what comes next. But I'm not leaving here without answers about Gabe. At least I know that. I wonder if I am dreaming. Everything feels so strange now. Wait. Okay, I thought I turned it off. Enable the music. Enable to mute the licensed music without playing on a live stream platform. All the things I'm feeling. This is such a Should good song, though. Okay, let's try this again. Okay, reset to default. On apply. With Alex though, I'm always feeling this key heel vibe with her. That kind of stuff. Like, she's always going like... Uh, um, she's always like just wondering that kind of stuff, and she has powers. Yes, I, I still have a job at Typhoon. They still have plans to expand. On one hand, there's the open road and the freedom to run away from my problems. On the other, helmet hair. At least you're being there. At least you're being safe. Tragically, now isn't the time to check out the rest of Haven. Come on. But it's not like we can find Mac anyway. And these overnight shifts really take it out of me. Okay. Yeah, my sleep schedule's fucked. Pinch girl. Oh, it's that guy's sister. I feel so bad for her. Getting sick of people feeling bad for me. your progress in Moondrop Ranch? Did you buy your chicken coop?
Thank you for your patience for the last few things. Things are very up in the air, but we hope to return to regular business hours. Stay tuned. No, I couldn't. I spent too much money romancing the... Here's the bridge. What the fuck? Mac? Fuck. Here we go. I'm so fucked. Can't hide from me forever, Mac. Mac. Hey, Alex. Look, it's not a good time. You owe me an explanation about what happened to Gabe. What? Costing me my girlfriend wasn't enough for you? Now you're gonna accuse me of killing Gabe too? Uh... <sighs> I get it. He died on your shift and you're freaked. But you have to come clean. Please. There's nothing I can tell you. Oh, come Back. on. Come on. He was my big brother. And he still has resentments of Gate because of, like, what he thinks with Riley and everything. Something definitely has him scared. If I could just push him over the edge. Can we please use your cool R of Howard? So what this Riley point? told me might do it. But I should make sure there isn't anything I still want to do around town first. There are a few things I want to do. I'd rather speak with Ryan. I should make sure there's nothing else I want to do before I confront Mac. Like, speak with Ryan, because, like... He might know what have also happened on that night. That forbidden night. I should make sure there's nothing else I want to do before I confront Mac. But how are we supposed to do that? I mean, like, we basically can't go past this, like, in um, invisible wall. Too bad I can't just run away from all this. Too bad I can't just run away from all this. Okay, we are going to try this again. Um, yeah, I have no idea how to do this. It may be better, because, like, I want to try to prevent, like, all that lagginess, though. I mean, it was like when I was playing Cyberpunk. Or just a little bit higher. Oh, hey. Whenever you're ready for that interview, give me a call. Whenever you're ready for that interview, give me a call.
Um, let's see. What else should we do? It's so pretty. If not for the paddling, kayaking would be super relaxing. Then how are you supposed to move? This is cool. In a wicker man sort of way. Hey look, there's Ethan. I wonder how he's doing. I mean, it's like he has lost dad as well. Losing Gabe's been hard enough for a supposed grown-up like me. But for Ethan... Let's talk to him. Hey, buddy. Hey, what's hey, up? Hey, Alex. Uh, Do you... want to talk about it? I'm fine. Okay. Okay. Definitely not fine. So young. He must be reading about Gabe. Well, let's see how the bird watchers are doing so far. Boy. Let's see. Eleanor. Alex, I'm so sorry about before. I really do appreciate your help. It just hit me so hard. Don't apologize. It's been hard for all of us. We should really talk to, like, Ryan, though. I mean, where on earth could he be? I better talk to Charlotte. Hey. Hey. I just saw Ethan. He's a pretty insightful kid. He knows how much you're hurting, even when you try to hide it from him. Instead of trying to be strong, maybe the best thing you can do is show him that it's okay to hurt. That's really helpful, Alex. Thank you. At this point, I think we're going to be calling Alex Auntie Alex. Or Aunt, um, Aunt Alex, that kind of stuff. I don't know, like... Yeah, I guess so, for Ethan. Aunt Alex. Mac trying to skip town is sketchy as shit. I bet I could use that to stoke his fear. Yikes. Even drugs. Let's see how she's doing so far. Like, we know that Riley is, like, being okay now, that kind of stuff, but then, like, I still think, like, she's just pretty upset about this whole thing, that kind of stuff. You know what I mean? Okay. Okay. That sucked. But 
At least I told her the truth. Uh, yeah. Ugh, I'm not sure we're even ready to, like, face Mac yet. I mean, like, I want to talk to Ryan, but then, like, I don't know. I mean, he does seem remorseful, but, ugh, what do you guys think? Like, will you forgive Ryan for what he has done, that kind of stuff? Sacrifice Gabe for us? Like, Mac trying to skip town is sketchy as shit. I bet I could use that to stoke his fear. <sighs> okay. I don't know where we're going to find Ryan, but I can't keep- I should make sure there's nothing else I want to do before holding I confront Holding this Mac. anymore with Mac. Come on, let's do this. Alright. Am I ready for this? Let's do this. Okay. Let's do this. Yeah. Your ex-girlfriend told me about your plans to skip town. This kid's turned That's red, so easy. we gotta be really, really careful about this. Oh God. It's not... I didn't do anything. Yeah. Whoa. Fuck off! <laughs> okay, all right, kid turned red. Oh, crap. Paparazzi! Not now! We're being spied on? Cameras have Deal with Mac when I get to him. For now, I need to learn everything I can. Okay. Typhon's always watching. They run this whole town. Okay. Mac feels like everyone's staring at him. Everyone thinks I killed him. They all hate me. Okay, this is getting really, really out of hand. Riley? It should have been you instead. Wait, we're seeing Alex? this through Max's, like, eyes or feelings, right? Oh, shit. No! What the hell? There are people out there! No, I told you to call it off! All the way they look to me at the wake. They all think I let him die. Mac? I know why you're lying. Typhon's forcing you to deny the call. Is this... Ugh. I know you tried to stop it. They fucked up, not you. Stop lying for them! You don't get it. This wasn't some accident. Oh, I crap. I told them you were down there, and they detonated anyway. On purpose? Why? I don't know. I swear. And then I get a message telling me to deny there was ever a call. So Mac was telling the truth? You gotta believe me. Cave and I, we didn't get along, but I, I didn't want him dead. And now, now Typhon's watching me. 
My girlfriend, she, she thinks I'm a murderer? My neighbors all hate me? I mean, What am I supposed to do? I think I can calm him down, but does he deserve it? I wonder if we should let him rage on. We fought him before. Right. Mac, come on. You gotta calm down, okay? We've been it up before when Dude, we were fearing his like anger aura, that kind of stuff. So. In case you have I know anything, what it's like we're ready to beat him up again. To be doubted. To have everyone think the worst of you. But the truth will come out. I'll make sure of it. But Typhon... If Typhon comes after you, they're gonna have to get through me too, okay? <sighs> oh. That was so much better than I thought it would be. Thanks. I actually feel a little better. <laughs> yeah, ah. well, you learn a thing or two hanging out with shrinks your whole life. <laughs> so, what are you gonna do now? Don't leave Haven. I'm gonna get to the truth. Damn. I can't believe Max has been telling the truth this whole time. Like, I don't know, like, the guy's a jerk, but he could probably have, like, clingy issues, that kind of stuff. And totally possessive. Like, clingy and possessive boyfriend. Hey. Yeah, it's... Can we talk? Where are you? Where's Ryan this whole time? Okay. He must be feeling guilty of what happened. I mean, this area, he'd probably feel haunted for what he's done. You were right. About Typhon, about Mac. Alex. Mac got the call. How do you know that? He got the call and he lied about it. Doesn't matter. Someone is putting pressure on him to keep quiet. Someone from the mine and- It doesn't matter! Rage. I keep coming here and playing it back. But it always ends the same. Ryan. He's dead. He's really dead, Alex. Okay, how do we calm him down? Get done. Whoa. Now we feel what Ryan feels. His world was crumbling apart ever since he cut the line. It was my fault. My job is to keep people safe. And I failed. 
you saved Ethan. We gotta remember that. You saved Ethan. That kid is alive right now because of you. She's wrong. I let her cross that log. I put Gabe in harm's way. I'm not a hero. I'm a coward. It wasn't his fault. I mean, like, Worst. there's no Worst. way that log would have supported his weight. You've got to stop torturing yourself. You did everything you could have. It doesn't matter. Gabe's dead. Because of me. Gabe. I'm so sorry. No. Don't. I forgive you. I forgive you. How could I not? <laughs> You're not alone. Aww. Oh, this is such a sweet scene. Oh. <laughs> whoa, whoa, hold on. <laughs> There's a guy in a gorilla suit? <laughs> Does he also jump off of the cliff and into the pool? No, no. He chases a guy in a banana suit. That guy <laughs> jumps off the cliff and into the pool. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry. This is a Mexican restaurant? Eh, nominally. <laughs> <laughs> the food is, uh, well, terrible. But it's Gabe's favorite place. <laughs> I tell you, he's the oldest 12-year-old I know. Aww. I'm sure that should be a compliment or not. Can I ask you something? Yeah, totally. Of course. You came up here to tell me that I was right about Mac. About him getting the call. How did you know? Um... Are we going to choose? There's something you should know about me. And it's going to be easier to show you than to explain it. I really thought the next person that she would this told was like Charlotte or something. Then really weird. Do you trust me? Uh... Okay. Think of something that just scares the shit out of you. Really focus. Until, until you, feel you feel it. Mac, Typhon, all of it. You're afraid you won't know how to handle it without Gabe. Never knew anyone so good at getting into and out of trouble. <laughs> oh, man, this one time. <laughs> Whoa, what's happening to him? Whatever it is you're thinking about right now, don't stop, okay? Keep going. Keep going. Okay. <laughs> what emotion is this?
Okay, he could have taken something or something like that. But this is just purity and joy. <laughs> Aura is really nice. I have to admit, though. Must be a good memory. I wonder if I can piece it together. Is that a shuffle? <laughs> oh, hey, this must have been like the one where Gabe had to do that community service thing. There was a photo of it on How the fridge. Think? Deeper than that, the Royal Canadian Mounted Police can spot a goose grave at a hundred paces. What's the a Mounties? Pace? <laughs> oh, come on, man! <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. How long were you gonna let me dig? <laughs> well, I wasn't gonna stop you. So they killed a Canadian goose and then basically like so they killed a Canadian goose and then like gave it a grave. <laughs> oh that's a lot of blood, huh? Gabe, okay, this is serious. Killing a Canadian goose is a violation of international law. Shut up. It is not. They're Canadian geese, Gabe. Property of the crown. The the crown of Property of the <laughs> crown, Gabe. <laughs> what do we do? <laughs> Gabe, goose. I see it. It'll move. It's <laughs> not moving. It'll move. <laughs> Gabe! <laughs> Okay. So, <laughs> did you finish burying the goose or not? <laughs> okay, also, property of the crown? <laughs> really? The British crown. Oh, they are technically protected under the Migratory Bird Treaty Act. <laughs> Wait, Canadian goose travel? <laughs> How? Um, yeah, we better tell this. So, I guess I have this power. I can see other people's emotions. They show up like an aura, and if I get too close, I... Feel the effects of it. I feel what they feel, as if I was feeling it myself. And when I focus, I can even understand why they're feeling it. And that's what you just did with, with me? Yeah. Whew. Some kind of power. Wait, did Ryan's hair Some change kidding. color? I mean, like, I know, like, when we first met him, it was, like, brunette it's, brown or something. It's only but now ever it's, like, been you know, the bad emotions Or blonde, before. that kind of stuff. But that... That was pure joy. Who else knows? Only Gabe. Gabe did. But... Now, now I, I guess, guess... Just you. Just you. And that's how I know Max terrified of Typhon. He reported Gabe's call, and they ignored it. Now they're putting pressure on him to toe the line. Okay, but... why? I don't know yet. Someone made the decision to let the blast go off. Seems like finding out who would be a good start. So... You're going after Typhon. I guess so. You'll need help. Oh, didn't expect that didn't expect such fast support. You don't have to. 
You stuck with me now. Okay, I guess that's true. You're welcome, I guess. Yeah. Thanks. Thank you. No. Thank you. What are we doing back in the record store? This one's for you, Gabe. I miss you. Aw, oh, man. Hold on, guys. Okay, perfect. Okay, that needs to stay on. Enable to while play a live stream platform that allows your arms to help make choices. Okay, that is supposed to be weird. Let's keep going. Recognize this. It usually represents the soul that just I didn't used to speak like this morning. Try to find like the afterlife or something. I couldn't. Or pass on to them from this world to the next world. Hearing everyone talk about him, about the life he had here with all of you, I lost the chance to have that. But even though I only had one day with him. He changed my life. I said, I didn't know if I belonged here. He told me that home isn't something you find. It's something you build. Like this, the Lord wrote in their wishes onto it. You 
God, there's an aura of joy already. Like with memories of Gabe. I can see it from all of them. Alex can see of it all. Hiding something? I will let you fly. I will say goodbye. Okay. Let's move on to the next chapter. This is just too interesting to stop to know what happens. Monster or mortal? Um... You have a superpower? You're both fucking with me, right? Steph now knows. Do Ryan and I look like the fucking with you type? It's all true. Fine. Then tell me what I'm feeling right now. You're feeling disbelief. Huh. <laughs> That's a good one, Ryan. You're actually a little annoyed. You feel hurt that we didn't tell you until now. Whether it's true or not, you don't like being left out. Ooh. Well, okay. <clears throat> oh shit. The foosball game. You knew exactly what to do. Yeah. Yeah, sorry. Being around memories of Gabe was making you so sad. I wanted to help. You did. I'm just surprised. That even worked. Never thought I'd have a freaky empath friend. Pretty wild. So, any sign of Diane today? No. But she was in yesterday working on her laptop. You said she was afraid of something around Gabe's death. If she's covering up what Typhon did, I bet there's proof. I hope so. If she comes in today, let's be ready with a plan. In the meantime, I've got to finish my shift. We're on it. Time to earn a paycheck. I should clean the dirty dishes around the bar. Ah, Colorado tap water. Hey, note. Chat, thank you for so much for remembering my birthday last week. That the Marco Equata Teclea was excellent. You are welcome over any time. You're your best cook by a long shot, Francisca. I'm not convinced this is totally sanitary, but what do I know? How do these bird washing contests even work? <laughs> Spring festival is nigh. Nigh, I say. 
Is it because Typhon's sponsoring it? Huh. What's with Ducky? It's gonna be a long night tonight. Always is. Same thing every year. Tonight's the spring festival. I wonder what's wrong. I'll talk to him in a little bit after. We need to, we gotta finish like, we gotta finish off some stuff. Hey, getting ready for the big LARP? Oh, hey, yeah, trying. I hope we can get Ethan into it. I guess he's just too sad about Gay being gone. Is everything okay? Yeah, I'm kind of addicted. Yeah. Into Don't worry, I'm sure he'll like it. So glad you like it. Not to be a single issue voter or anything, but fuck Typhon. Okay, I can agree. I couldn't agree more. <sighs> Okay. Propaganda. Hey, How are you? I'm doing okay. Thank you, dear. I really appreciate your help from a couple weeks ago. It means a lot to me. Of course. I'm glad I could help. Girl from Rome. Gosh, I really miss that song. They used to play it in here all the time. Weird. I've never heard it. Maybe Jed knows where it went? Diane? I'll be right with you. I better check in with Steph and Ryan. Boy, Steph and okay. Ryan. She's here. What's the plan? Well, we have two plans actually. But we're still workshopping them. Workshopping them. What does workshopping mean, exactly? It means Ryan won't admit that my plan is perfect. Okay, okay. I am gonna ignore so that here's part. here's what I'm thinking. I asked Diane out on a date. Wait, what? And she's so into it. She doesn't notice one Ryan Lucan swiping her laptop. Ryan carries said laptop upstairs, acquiring damning evidence. Maybe Diane and I still hook up? Not important. Um... That's your plan? Oh my god, please tell me you have something better. <laughs> I do. Okay. Now to be clear, it's the same plan. What? Except, I'm the distraction. Look, Steph, I don't even think she's gay, alright? She's probably into the rugged mountain man type. Well, she was having dinner with Ducky a few nights, are. a couple nights ago, anyway. <laughs> okay, maybe these plans do need some more time. What? It's a simple plan, literally two steps. You just need to choose the hotter distraction. <laughs> okay, I'm not doing that. You're the only tiebreaker we have. What happens if you forget step two, and then you get yelled at for saying it was this two-step plan? But I'm choosing Ryan. Let's go with Ryan. This Ryan? This is like a bad dream. Oh, come on. Look, I appreciate the, the effort, but we don't even know if she has anything worth stealing yet. I'm just gonna try to figure it out. talking to her. Maybe I can get her worked up and read her emotions. 
I'll let you know if I need that distraction. Good luck. Your usual. Thanks, Alex. Okay. What's the best way to rile her up? Um... This one. I know you're a very responsible... I know Typhon's responsible for my brother's death. I don't know how. And I don't know why yet. But I will find out. Oh, great. We just started making an enemy. Let's... Not like she has anything involved with it, with Typhon. Alex, I can assure you that Typhon is committed to a full and open investigation. We want to find those responsible and hold them accountable just as much as you do. That's the truth. That also sounds like propaganda. She's got a great poker face, unlike Mac. But let's see what she's really feeling. Time for our reading. Let me try and read her first. Wait. I'm sick of the lies and I'm sick of taking the heat for this company. She's pissed. If I can stoke her anger at Typhon, maybe I can find out more. Uh. Good beer? Yep. William Bloom, huh? Yeah, he's the best. Do you belong to a church around here? Hmm? Oh, no. Honestly, I'm sort of lapsed with all that. I do miss it, though. Is that your niece and nephew? They must be proud to have a super-powered businesswoman for an aunt. I suppose. They do look up to me. I try to be the best role model I can. We're gonna now ask about napkins. Do you have, um, enough napkins for the table? Uh, yeah. I'm fine, thanks. Would they ever speak to me again if they found out what I really do? Ooh! Would they ever speak to me again if they found out what I really do? Integrity to our very core. What? Oh, yeah. That's our motto. It's a motto. Okay. Now I need to pick something that will push Diane's emotions over the edge. Look, I know you're not a bad person. But my brother is dead because of the choices you and Typhon made. How does that make you feel? I actually want to know. Alex, I... We... Typhon is doing everything we can to address the situation. That's the truth. Okay? Okay, it's still... S okay, annoyed. So we can see that and just seeing the same things right. over and over again. That's the emotion I was looking for. Time to explore Diane's anger about Typhon. Okay, concentrate, Brandon. Or Alex. I mean, both of us. Whoa. Another power surge again. Okay, time to find out what Diane is really hiding. Typhon brought me here, and look where it got me. Damn them all. Does Her it phone. fall within the tolerable limit? Well, as I say in the report, there's a small chance that debris from the detonation could- It's a simple question. Falls within the tolerable limits. Wait, there's something else. Is that a USB stick? I didn't join Typhon to cover up a murder. 
If they try to pin this on me, I'll have everything I need to fight back. So Holy she's shit. forced to like... She must have evidence on the USB stick. Oh, looks like I'll need a distraction after all. So... Ugh. So, the thing is that she's just trying to fight Ivan as well? And she knew the whole time? Do it. Okay, but I'm getting a little bit of jealous of Ryan, like, doing this to Diane. I'm jealous now. I'm jealous. I'm jealous. Diane? Hey, Ryan. What's up? Well, if you're free later, I was thinking we could go on a hike together. Mm. That should There's be some me going on a hike beautiful with trails Ryan. up in the mountains. Oh, that sounds like a nice idea. Uh Sounds like fun. Sounds fun. Brian knows all about the local flora and fauna of Haven. Okay, that should be me going out with Brian. Brian tell her about the flora and fauna. Oh, uh, well, that right there is a Colorado pinion jay. It can hold more than 40 seeds at a time with an expandable esophagus. Expandable esophagus. That is impressive. <laughs> so, what do you say? Hey, no rush. He's not going anywhere. Mull it over. Get back to him. Anyway, gotta go. <laughs> See ya. Okay, at least she didn't actually take her out. Because I'm jealous. Now. <laughs> and we better hurry before she, like, misses it before it's gone. Holy shit, that was epic! Totally insane! insane. My heart is pounding. <laughs> Ryan, real talk. I think Diane actually wants you. I know, I can't believe it! <laughs> hey! Oh, man. Okay, that was terrifying. I know I'm cracking up, but that was legit terrifying. Yeah. I hope it was worth the risk. Password protected. Guess I'm not surprised. I'll bring this to Riley. See if she's willing to help. She's a whiz at computer stuff. In the meantime, we have a LARP to do. Grab your hat and meet me at the park. And don't forget your guitar, okay? I just started two weeks ago. Is the guitar really necessary? What? H how can you be a bard without a guitar? The bard's whole job is to musically regale people. Well, how about that distortion well, field or whatever thing that I basically real. like selected? So, did you finish the thing? Yeah, barely. It took me all night. I haven't carved like that in ages. All right, I need to grab my guitar and the hat that Steph got me. Okay, phone. We will be closed for regular business this afternoon in order to participate in Steph's Gunshot Life action game. We'll see if you all like this evening for the Spring Festival. Live action game. It's called LARP. Wow. Typhon officially clears Typhon of any wrongdoing in death of local man at the hands of Typhon explosions. You gotta be kidding me. Okay. Okay, let me grab my hat. 
Where exactly is this? A chipmunk sculpture. Ducky's gift to me for finding his booze. It's, um, it's a unique expression of gratitude. Okay, let's go with that. I found some really cute photos of Gabe and Ethan on this thing. Why did she got a chest? Huh. There it is. Oh shit. The feather on the hat must have fallen off. Maybe I can find it. It was in the box the whole time. Gabe's last effects from the coroner. Pike dropped it off a few days ago. Guess I've been avoiding looking through it. Okay. You can take the kid out of juvie. His keys. Oh. Your, hurry, um, your hat. Hurry up and finish your shift. Love, Char. One match left. I don't know why, but this must have been really special to Gabe. Don't give up. Aww. Never know when you'll need a light. Okay, there's a reason why we have up, lighters Gabe. and fire starters for a reason. I better find that feather. Steph is a stickler for details. Okay, I saw a bunch of feathers in here. Yeah, I don't need to know what that was for. Uh, robot, Gabe's effects. I don't even know if I'm doing this right, but it felt like I had to do something. Tea, fruit, and incenses. Okay. Uh, feels right. Wish I'd taken Steph's advice. Thanks for the Ugh. Thanks for the fo foosball guy. I mean, I only eat these one things at a time. Steph, I will murder you. Alex, Steph told me you'd be willing to pay lay in the, uh, um play our open mic night. I wager it. I really need to help loosen the break um the break the ice. Can you make it, Jed? Okay, to do list. We're one step closer now. Figure out Darian's deal. Turn out corporate law. Turns out corporate law is complicated. Duh. All three dudes give me this crazy high price. Pass. Research other typhoon sites in the U.S. abroad. Ryan, spy on miners in the Black Lantern. Alex, do you want me to get fired? No. <laughs> Couldn't figure out the dark web. Done. Done. And there to know. Make sure you have a VPN or something like that. I don't know. Maybe in the drawer. I like this one. Life in Haven would be a lot worse without these two weirdos. Oh, it wouldn't. Oh. A housewarming gift from Eleanor. She said Gabe loved these little dudes. She no loves gnomes. He loves gnomes. A dire rat joined your party. One day, I'll stop being a freeloader. For now, I'm just grateful. I appreciate your offer to start paying rent. Take a few months to fill up your picky bank first, then we can talk.
Where are you supposed to find these feathers? Wow. Steph is a rock star for putting this together. Ethan is gonna flip. Ooh. Do we even need the feathers? Ah, oh, here they are. This feather separates the buskers from the Alex the Bard, ready to serve. Hey, Alex, it's Steph. Sorry, I had to run out like who's reading. Okay. <laughs> okay. Ryan, a loser with a valid license. You guys are killing me. The plan is to go. Distract, distract. Come on, let's... Hopefully Ethan likes this. Ethan. Hey. What's up, Ethan? I don't need, like, cheering up or whatever. Okay. So... Maybe this wasn't the most subtle idea, but... Mm. Gabe was so excited to LARP with you. I bet he'd really want you to do it. I do want to do this. It's just... <sighs> I'm feeling his aura again. Everyone's been working so hard. And if I'm not happy, they'll all be disappointed. Whoa. So Must be weird having a bunch of adults pressuring you to dress up in a costume and act like you're having fun. Just... Yeah. Especially my mom. She always looks so... Sad. Cause I'm like bummed out. But I can't just pretend. Don't. So don't pretend. Just be yourself. Or yourself with a foam sword and a funny hat. But, what if I'm still, you know, not having fun? Uh... Then don't. That's fine, too. No one will be disappointed in you for being you. Yeah. All right. But I don't want to do it alone. You have to help me. Fine. Of course. Thanor, the Monster Slayer! Thanks to the gods and all the heavens you've come. I am in desperate need of a great hero. Could you be the one? Please, tell me of your exploits. Um. Uh, there's a bunch of stuff. 
Maybe my bard can sing something about me. Oh. Sure. Uh... Ancient Kraken sounds cooler. A Kraken ate a city every year until it died on Thanor's spear. My goodness. You must be Thanor's bard, Alexandra, whose songs have magical powers. It sounds like you are exactly the heroes I need. My name is King Tabor. The age of monsters has come upon my kingdom. Horrible creatures stalk the streets. My people live in constant fear. But this hope, an ancient prophecy, describes three mysterious uh. gems known as soul jewels that can save us all. I need you to go search the kingdom, survive whatever's out there, and bring me back those jewels. Do you understand? Yeah, totally. Yeah. Yes. Good. Then you, you must go even now. My people are counting on you. Should we start with the main road? Okay. Time to find some jewels. Okay, phone, time for text message. We are open, blah, blah, blah. Orleans. Okay, what? This is kind of exciting. Um... How do we know where to look? I think we don't know. It's a true adventure. Oh. What's this? Is that a scroll of paper? Scroll of healing restores all your... Okay. What is that? It's a magic scroll we can use in fights. Oh, awesome. We should find as many as we can. Okay. This is where the ammunition comes in. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's a wolf. A dire wolf. Shit, what do we do? I think we have to fight it. Ooh, this is like one of those role-playing games. Okay. Uh, Alex. Magic. Distortion field. Distortion field. One sound damage for the next two turns. Ethan. We need a barrier. Shield of courage. Ah. Two damage. Ah, uh, my ears are ringing. Ah, uh, Alex. Stirring him. Double Thanor's next attack. Uh, burning blade. Burning blade. Two damage, <clears throat> and you're on fire for the next two turns. <clears throat> Protected by shield of courage. Yeah, but that uh, lost his ult. I'm still on fire. Who turns uh, though? My ears are ringing. <laughs> Actually, no. this is so much easier. Loot. Oh, cool! I learned a magic attack. <laughs> One damage to allies. Better be nice to Thanor. New skills acquired. Class Warrior. Skill Fire Blast. Tight Magic. In fact, three damage to enemies plus one damage to allies. Maybe only once per battle? Okay. Damage to allies is worse than like once per ally or something. What do you think this key is for? Maybe it unlocks something in one of these stores. Riley. I should probably drop in on Riley and thank her in person. I found something.
Let's go. Aren't I supposed to be the one teaching you how to throw? You'd have to be athletic to do that. <laughs> Whoa, go, go easy, easy on, on me. me. Maybe you can teach me the finer points of craft beer. Sorry. Did you say she stole your crochet needles? Did we really just kill a dire wolf? I guess so. What did you think of that fight? Uh, hard. It was definitely harder than I thought. I'm Thanor. Right. Go get him. Could there be something down the alley? All right. my dead lover talking <laughs> Shh, they're here woe is me woe is me the beware of river monster <sighs> don't even know <laughs> some kind of snake See, i guess All right, more Final Fantasy style battle. Do we have to fight it? Why wouldn't we? Okay, besides, I can't believe that fire blast causes one alley point, that kind of stuff. I mean, it's kind of cute, nice. isn't it? Well, what are you talking about? In prior, in prior perspective, it's gonna attack. In what do you want to do? Whatever. Let's just fight it. In Yu-Gi-Oh, sometimes in some of these cards, that kind of stuff, Bring you have it to pay on, a thousand snake me. life points in order to activate a card. Like a thousand points. Ethan, attack, burning blade. Burning blade! Wait, it's a water monster. One damage! <clears throat> and you're on fire for the next two turns! Uh. Untuned cord! <clears throat> One damage. So we weaken it a little bit. Oh. Two damage! What? Ah! Uh, I'm still on fire! Um, Alex, that's it. Stirring him! Double Thanor's next attack! Burning Blade! That should give us four damage. Two damage, <clears throat> and you're on fire for the next two turns. Spitting Venom! Ah, I'm poisoned! Ah, I'm still on fire! Um, Ow! Poison damage. Scroll of healing. Scroll of healing. Thanor and I are restored to full health. All negative status effects removed. Okay. Next, I um. Next, I play um. Next, I activate Alex's ability or whatever her LARP name is. Distortion field. Distortion field. One sound damage for the next two turns. And Ethan. Shield of, shield courage. of courage. To protect my monster. Ah! Two damage. Hey! Ah! I'm still on fire. Ah! My ears are ringing. And one fire, fire blast. blast. It cost me a thousand life Three points damage for this one. <clears throat> one to her. What? Sorry. Worth it. Okay. Uh, stirring him. Stirring him. Double Thanor's next attack. Protected by Shield of Courage. Ah. Uh. My ears are ringing. Ethan. I mean. 
<coughs> Four damage. Four damage should be able to like be enough to take it down. <laughs> okay, now we're kind of like More loot. speaking of Yu-Gi-Oh, that kind of stuff. All right, let's make some ears bleed. Class barred. Okay, this comes in handy. Wait, what's that? It's like a dragon scale or something. Maybe it's got magical powers. Let's hang on to it. Yeah. Okay, one key, two coins, and one chest of a scale. Are you bummed that we had to kill the snake? Nah, it's fine. It'll live again. Scroll of Numbness. One dodge. You and your allies will dodge the next attack. May only be used once. Found a scroll? Yeah. We could have used that like earlier today. At least Ethan's having fun. Okay, we handled the river serpent. Take. Ah, uh, hello, scroll. Oh, not scroll. Well, that guy's still pissed. A scroll in need of a home. Scroll of healing. Okay. Got another scroll. Cool. I bet there's something fun in the record store. I wonder how Riley's doing with the USB. Uh... Such a gorgeous day. I wish I used it better. Can I recommend LARPing? Oh, finally, we can get on this road. Don't think the LARP goes that far. Damn it! We could try the down all on the other side. I wonder what we'll find at the Bridge of Flowers. What is all this? What did you just find? A gold coin. Do you think there's more of them? I don't know. Let's keep looking. Oh. 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 Oh shit! Troll! Incoming! He's got a soul jewel right there. Oh, 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 okay. You like my belt? <laughs> it's made of human skin. Ew. <laughs> what do you think we should do? Duck. Let's take him. Uh, I'll okay. smash you to bits. Horrid disharmony. Three damage. Ugh, but two damage onto Alex. Shield of we need courage! A defense, though. Throwing rock. Protected by shield of courage. Okay. Distortion field. One sound damage for the next two turns. Uh, 
We still need shielding Shield courage. Shield of courage. Throwing rock. Protected by shield of courage. Um, how many? Um, shielding courage. Oh, now you tell me. Ah, my ears are ringing. Um, let's see. String of him. Stirring him. Double Thanor's next attack. But then we still need the shield of courage. Shield of courage. And then, like when we um, when we weaken him Stunning a little bit, we can still punch. like protected by shield of courage. Ah, my ears are ringing. Burning blade. Burning blade. Two damage, <clears throat> and you're on fire for the next two turns. I hope this works. Untuned cord, <clears throat> one damage. <sighs> Double slam. Oh, ah. Damn it. Ah, I'm still on fire. For the next two turns. Shield of courage. Okay. Distortion field, <clears throat> one sound <clears throat> damage for the next two turns. Throwing rock. Protected by shield of courage. Ah, I'm still on fire. Ah, my ears the are fire, ringing. Uh, the fire pack is going to like run out pretty soon. But we gotta keep shielding shield courage. Shield of courage. Untuned cord. <clears throat> One damage. <sighs> Throwing rock. Protected by shield of courage. Ah, my ears are ringing. Shield of courage. Only this barrier like works. Stirring him. Double Thanor's next attack. Double slam. Ah. Protected by shield of courage. A shield of courage should have also protected them. <clears throat> Four damage. <clears throat> okay. Yeah. How did we lose, though? I got. Musical acquire class warrior strike of wrath attack during. Okay, comes in handy. One down, two to go. Yup. Hey, does anyone know how long to play the game? To play the game thing is going on. Is there time to sign up? Looks super. Sorry, dude. We're pretty deep in this part. Enjoy the show, though. Okay, that troll is scary. I admit it. Yep. Nothing to admit. I wonder how Riley's doing with the USB. I bet there's something fun in the record store. Appreciates my. Oh yeah. I hear you've dealt with the serpent and the. Tr Please, Please knock, knock twice. Go for it. Monster or mortal? Mortal. Come in.
Okay. Sorry about the lock. These are dangerous times. Welcome to the Magpie Emporium. Ooh. Oh. So, this is like a magic shop. I'm gonna take a look around a bit, okay? Okay. Let's see what Steph's done to the place. I'd like to try one of those bard instruments, please. You'll need to schedule a private appointment. That's not ominous at all. Read. The Sorcery Guild hereby authorized the Magic Emporium to buy and sell items with the magical property. The guild assumes no responsibility for the consequences. Magic does have a price to pay. This is a tapestry? He's forging the Sky Sword of Power. Oh yeah? One day, Thanor's gonna find it. As a classically trained bard, I gotta say, this music's not bad. It's a record store in reality. That actually looks legit. Golems. Animation fee not included. Oh, Steph. Golems. Oh, Steph. Spell. Spells. Very Order cute, still. Steph. Necromancy. Spells for sale? To members of the Sorcery Guild only. Sorry. Seeking insight? Draw a card. Huh. I guess I will. I mean, I do have a set of tarot. What do I want insight about? I really wish things would stop changing. For once. The Wheel of Fortune. A card of decisive and inevitable change in the eternal cycle of life. So, going for Alex, things are just going to go rocky, but then it's going to climb up that guy, back up again, and then back down again. Hmm. Really? Card of self surrender. Faith accepts an unknown that embraces it. Steph's willing to embrace the unknown, so it'd be something like to be about her. Is that true for Ryan? I Card, hope so. Inspiration, optimism, and hope. Future. He does have a lot of hope for the future, though. I mean, like, he seems to be a joy to be around with. It's official. I think I have a crush on Ryan. Thanks. Typhon. Holy shit. Too real. Yeah. Yikes. Well, they're probably going to go under a major change anyway. I mean, like, okay, I'm not saying about Gabe's death or anything like that, but I'm saying, like, probably after the fall of Typhon, maybe things would get a lot better. You were right, Gabe. I'm a superhero. Valkyrian? Warning. Cat is cursed. Do not pet. Yeah, no need to warn me. I guess some heroes are into Bill bards with flashy guitars. But I'm glad Thanor has better taste. The streets used to be full of people. The soul sapphire's right there. For sale. Why is this 10,000 gold? Was I too generous? It was originally 20,000, but... No, I meant... Never mind. Troll dust? Do you think we'll run into any more trolls? I doubt it. They're pretty territorial. I like the scroll of advantage. Let's just do. You and your allies again gain extra turn. May only use once. We have a scroll of healing already, right? Yeah, but you can never have enough healing. That's a good point. One gold, please. One gold, please. So we're going to buy a lot of magic stuff.
Okay, we're out of here. Okay, time for this blacksmith. Everything okay? You seem pretty, um, grumpy. Bah! What a thankless life, being a smith in the age of monsters. Whoa, he's really into this. What did you need again? Sun silver. The components for sun silver. Puh. Okay, that was a little bit too real. No one appreciates my fine work. Wasn't there a soul jewel in the record store? How are we supposed to even get that? Oh crap, we don't have the map anymore. Okay. Don't think a LARP goes that far. Great. Don't think a Wolf Den, Actric Emporium. LARP goes that far. Okay. Let's go back to the Black Lantern. Looks like the Black Lantern is part of the LARP. Whoa. What's that about? I hope it's just paint. Looks like you dropped something, Diane. Wanna look in here? Yeah. Let's go in. I can't believe this. How did Sniff even pull this off in, like, one day? What happened here? Whoa. Fellow survivors, I see. You hurt? Are you hurt? <laughs> Hardly my first monster attack. I know an escape trick or two. Go cool. off. Do you know what this key is for? Belonged to Barry, the tavern keeper. That's his leg over there. Ew. Look, oh. I know it's like fake and so all and for large, but... If you but... want to try all Ew. of the locks... I'm sure he won't stop you. Let's see what we can find around here. Rolling pin. I actually feel bad for that person. Ugh, rough day for Barry the Tavern Keeper. So gorgeous. Where does Steph get all this stuff? And how did she get all this stuff so quickly? Feynor! Did you see this? That's got to be it! It's one of the jewels! Don't you think this is too easy how the gnome just let us take it all of a sudden? Only one more jewel left! Let's do th Ugh. Rough day for Barry the Tavern Keeper. Wanted posters. This kingdom has serious problems.
At least the adventures are exciting Guess in those Lawrence days. Lawrence is going to need a new business advisor. Wow. Sheet music? What's that doing here? What happened to the rest of the music? Hypnosis sounds good. What happened to the rest of the music? Don't care what um House Bard. Sorry, Steph. Alexandra is pretty happy with her current gig. In retrospect, this is so obviously a decoy. A what? Steph really went all out in here. No okay. longer a problem. It is believed that You're welcome, Swampel citizens. Has taking residence flow, use extreme caution, or. Oh man, we could have known about the troll ahead of time. Godspeed. Godspeed. Oh, definitely. What I found in that chest. Dodge your bleed. Damn it! Nice work, Thanor. Oh shit, how do we use any of these scrolls? There was some really interesting stuff in there. Now you look pale. I told you so. Hey, let's hear your riddle. There are three, it is said, heroes long dead, fashioned into soul jewels, blue, violet, red. What are their names? Do not be misled. Uh... How are we supposed to know that? Maybe we can look for some clues. The king told us before about something. I wish we could go back to the tavern when it's full of people. It was full of people. Alive people. Obviously. Good point. I mean, there's absolutely... Ooh, dollars. Huh. Did Ethan drop this? We shouldn't go back until we found all three jewels. But what are we supposed to do next? I mean, we shouldn't go back until we found all three jewels. But what are we supposed to do? I mean, like, basically, that, um, besides, the third soul jewels taste like 10,000 coins. Where are we supposed to find 10,000 coins under short notice? Let's go to the peach. Hmm. Scroll of healing. We're like master scroll seekers. Yup. Peach ice cream cake? I don't know. I did good. I mean, like, I, I do like people... peaches. Hey, kid. You responsible for that massacre in the Black Lantern? What? Okay. I saw that, like, right before you picked it up. Okay, you can have the credit. No, I don't care. I'm just saying. Too late. Credit's yours. Okay, where have we not visited?
We visited everywhere, like the castle, the King's Road, Magic Emporium. Sign. Due to an unfortunate bunch of the monsters that apparently remains closed until further notice. Wasn't there a soul jewel in the record store? No one appreciates me. Which was, which cost ten thousand dollars or gold. Okay, safety precautions. Wonder if they have drills for this. Yeah, there's those who matter. Cast protection circles, create illusions in other directions. Await Archmage assistance, not guaranteed. Very cute stuff. Portals, necromanceries. Well, that was interesting. It's a wonder Valkyrie's ever hungry. What, with all the human flesh I assume she consumes? Mm. The streets used to be full of people. Alexandra would love to play these sometime. And so would I. Would you consider giving us that sapphire? For one gold? This isn't a charity. We need the sapphire right away. It's for a quest to end the age of monsters. I've heard. There's a magical fish that lives in the River of Sorrows. Bring me back one of its scales, and I'll give you the sapphire in return. Actually, we already have that. One magic fish scale. Impressive. Well, then, here's my end of the bargain. The soul... jewel. We've got all three! We can go back to the king now! Yep. Let's do this. We've still got coins. Should we spend them before we go back to the king? Mm. Let's just hurry back. Okay. Yeah. No one. I wonder what happened to the rest of the town anyway. Okay, we've like returned for like Oh my god. It's my mom. <laughs> Feynor, 
the monster slayer. You've come at last. Do you remember me from your past adventures? Uh, You're Natheria, the forest spirit. You have done well on your quest. The forest notices. She offers a treasure for you to claim. Look, there. What is that? What is that? The Sky Sword. It's the Sky Sword of Power! It's exactly the same as I drew in the comics! It's got the pincer, and the same grip, and it's got this part for the jewels! How do they do it? 3D printer? Can I really take it? Promise me you'll only use it for good. Helping others and stuff like that. Okay. seeing in this point oh crap did he actually brought us back to time if you please okay the prophecies fulfilled at last now Thanos might is unsurpassed I'll take that sword now, and the jewels! Cravius, Lord of the Underworld! I should have known King Tabor was you all along! You fools! You have collected the jewels I need and brought them right to me! We've gotten this far. We can beat him. Okay. Give them to me! So, what we're gonna do... Why could I be so real like this one when we had to fight those other three creatures? This is our hardest duel yet. Scroll of healing. Okay. This could have been so much handier. Shield of courage. Ah! Ah! What was that for? Stirring him. No! We were supposed to be attacking. Strike of wrath. Oh. 
Well... Horrid Disharmony! Okay. Uh... Burning Blade! Oh, no, wait. Alex I takes one damage. The fury of hell! <laughs> Death to all who defy me! We should have put out the shield. healing untuned core okay um shield of courage i have actually really thought that i like covered both of them Alex being the target that is so like major Curse unfair. This fire. Untuned core. And then fire, fire blast. blast. Sorry. Okay, um... Burning Blade! Maybe putting up the shield was a good idea. Curse this fire! Worried. Now we can feel it. I guess he's traumatized with Gabe Shit. and that kind of stuff. Gabe's dead. Gabe's dead because of me. It's my fault. I killed Gabe. I killed Gabe. I killed Gabe. Ethan. Listen to me. It wasn't your fault. At all. It wasn't. Okay? It wasn't. Aww. Charlotte? Back here? Whoa. An art studio. Hey. Thanks for coming. Of course. Ethan's dad already pick him up? Yeah, they just left. I just wanted to thank you. Ethan needed today. Uh... Yeah. It was a group effort, but I'm glad I could help. He thinks the world of you, you know. After everything, I think you're sort of his hero. He's sort of mine. How creative he is, 
You must be so proud of him. He was so thrilled to see you show up with the sword. I think that was mostly about the sword. Maybe. But I think he was happy to see you in his world. <sighs> sorry. I'm sorry. I'm okay. Charlotte? God, Alex, don't mind me, okay? Just a lot going on. <sighs> I don't mind you at all. Do you want to talk about it? You're really sweet, but I'm okay. Thanks for swinging by. I'll see you at the festival. Uh. Charlotte, I can tell some- Said no! Fuck, don't you listen? Whoa. Shit. Okay, let's try to concentrate on this. This was a mistake. Where did that anger come from? Steph. I think we're pretty missing two. There we go. This is like what we did with Eleanor in the flower shop, so we just gotta see what makes her is so intense. Maybe there's something here that can tell me why. Gabe, it's your fault. Why would you teach me to need someone again just to go and leave me all alone? Whoa. Is that Gabe? It's your fault. Everyone loves you. But I can't look at you without thinking about how fucked everything is since you came into my life. Another part of the sculpture. Gabe, Alex, Ethan? Ryan, it's your fault. You were supposed to protect us. Why couldn't you? Wait, it's supposed to be a sculpture of Ryan, like- She's so angry at everyone around her, but there's something else here. Probably to represent Ethan. What is wrong with me? I can't let myself feel this way. When did I become such a fucking monster? Ethan, you 
blame him. I'm a bad mom, Alex. Charlotte. Whoa. Charlotte. She blames Ethan I for all the killing. My son, Alex. For killing Kate, for like going into the mines. He's sweet. And he's creative. And he's the most important thing in the entire universe to me. And I hate him. Oh. For so long, it was just me and him. It took so long to learn how to be okay with that. And I was. But then... Kate... I can deal with hating Ryan. Or you. Or even Gabe. But Ethan... If he had just listened, Gabe would still be alive. Whoa. It all comes back to that. What you're feeling makes more sense than you think. Your pain matters too. None of it fucking matters! He's dead! I wish I were too. Why would you even say that? This anger could kill her. And nothing I'm saying is helping. What if... I could just take it away. I can do it. I can take her anger from her. And where are you supposed to and do what with it? I mean, how do you even what redirect would that anger? What do to her? What would it do to me? And even if I can, should I? It's the only way. Yeah. Yes, I... I think so. Shit. Did I freak out on you? I'm sorry, Alex. I'm... not sure what came over me. Uh, yeah. Are you sure you're okay? Feel sick. Yes. I think so. Just... Maybe I blacked out for a minute? I guess that's what happens when you don't sleep. Not sleep! Huh. I wrecked my sculpture. It seems so crazy in here, but I feel... How do I feel? Hey. Go home, you're exhausted. I'm serious, it's okay. I'll see you tonight. Oh, I can't believe we could actually take that anger and like redirected it to somewhere else. That's like freaking cool.
Okay, okay. Hear me out. Is Typhon run by the Illuminati? What? That would explain the conspicuously triangle-shaped logo. Boom. Finally cracked it. <laughs> hey. Alex. So, how did things go with Charlotte? It was intense. But I think maybe she'll be okay. Honestly, I'm not sure how to even talk about it. That's okay. You don't have to. So, please tell me that the USB stick revealed all of Typhon's secrets. Not yet, but... Alex. We found a recording of Gabe's call. Oh, wow. I should probably listen to that. I need to know. We're here for you. Okay? Okay. Let's do this. Gabe's call. Type in safety. Mac? It's me. Fuck off, Chin. Yeah, yeah, okay, just listen. I need you to call off the explosion. Ethan's in the blast radius. Shit. He could get killed. What the hell's wrong with you? He snuck off. We're, we're up here right now, trying to find him. Mac, please. No right. way. I'm on it. We'll hold the blasts. Fuck. You can't imagine the headaches this will create for me. Thanks, Smack. Whatever. Just doing my job. They just ignored him. <laughs> That's so fucked. You know it's bad when Mac turns out to be the good guy. Alex. You okay? So was Max We're gonna get Mac him. lying again? I promise. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, it doesn't matter. None of it fucking matters. He's dead. He's Whoa. Fuck that. I don't need to take this. I should follow her. We'll be right downstairs, all right? Right now, all that matters is taking these fuckers down. This USB stick has what I need. Time to dig through it. If that happened to me, what's happening to Charlotte? A lot worse than I expected. A key part of any good investigation. Okay. Thanks for spilling your guts. Brian brought this down from his station. Okay. A cold case and a warm beer. Gabe's call came in from the sat phone at 8.41 p.m. I should find the next call and see if that has any information. I know what happened to Gabe at 8.41 p.m. Type okay. in safety. Mac? It's me. Fuck off, Chin. Yeah, yeah, okay, just listen. I need you to call off- Lena, it's Diane. We have a problem. You're kidding. There's a kid lost in the mountains near the pit. We need to postpone. Lena? Haven is your site, Diane, and therefore this is your decision. I know I don't need to remind you of the stakes. Someone could be hurt. Or killed. We've been over this. 
Anyone up there has disregarded posted notices and accepted full liability. We're talking about a child. I'm just asking for one day. If you postpone tonight's scheduled blast, you put Rhea in jeopardy. That puts the whole company in jeopardy. Shit, that that's fucked up. Then do the math and make the right call. Email me when it's done. I will. So Typhon thought Rhea, whatever that is, was worth risking our lives. Let's hope Diane's email sheds more light. What is Rhea? This is the email Diane mentioned. So what is Rhea? Okay, I warn you, Lena. But I fucking warned you. Rhea went off undetected and you insisted. Now someone is dead. You better have a plan. I'm not going down for this. At least not alone. Rhea went off undetected. A second blast went off that night? What did Lena say? Without the scheduled blast, Rhea will be discovered. It was a diversion. They set off the blast that killed Gabe to cover up another one somewhere else. That's why they couldn't wait. If I can find out where that blast went off, it might tell me why it was so important. Hopefully, though. I guess Mac was right to be so paranoid. Okay. This is about Rhea. But it doesn't tell me where it was. Rhea, Sinjur, charge the needed. Rhea. This is Rhea. Fuck. This map's too small to tell where this is. I need a map. Okay. So Rhea should be like... Damn it, I don't have my cursor. That's the site of the 2008 Typhon mine collapse. Why would they set off a blast in their current mine to cover up a blast in their old mine? Didn't Typhon just have inspections around the old site? They weren't mining for anything. They were burying something. Okay, no way. But bearing what? We've got to tell Steph and Ryan. Alex made Diane angry. Whoa. And that, my friends, will be for another time. It's kind of late, and I'm getting really, really tired. But I hope you all have a good night. Wherever you are in the world. Or a good day wherever you are in the world. Bon nuit. And sayonara for t um, And sayonara. And those of you that are watching this, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on Twitch, Instagram, and Twitter as well. Good night, wherever you are, or good day, wherever you are, and enjoy.